eating waffles, eating pancakes and eggs and making some normal stuff. That ain't normal. We live. We live. We live. Your boy is live. Your boy is live. We live. We live. We live. And we live. We live. We live. We live. We live. Your boy is live. Come holla at your boy. We live, people. We lie, we lie, we lie, we lie, we lie. Come on, let your boy. Come on, let your boy. Come on, tiny bay. B. What's really good? Your boy is live at your boy. Shut a laugh for your boy. Shut a laugh. Shut a laugh. Shut a laugh for your boy. All right. Shut a laugh. Shut a laugh. Shut a laugh for your boy. How y'all people doing? Happy. What's today? Tuesday. Today is not Monday. Today is Tuesday. Is today Tuesday? Is it Tuesday today? Is today Tuesday? Or is today Monday? Today Tuesday. Happy Tuesday, people. Happy Tuesday to you people. How you doing? How y'all doing? Did y'all have a good... Did y'all have a good weekend? Did y'all have a good time? A good three-day weekend did y'all have a good three-day weekend tony lee what's good marvet what's good uh but you are soft what's good did y'all i'm glad to see y'all made it back safe i uh spent the whole weekend in the pool and uh, you you know what you spent your weekend in the pool uh tana baby spent her weekend in the pool Tony Lee, how you spend your weekend, brother? How you spend your weekend? Joe Blow, what's good? Uh, Ella J, what's good? Tony Webb, what's good? Romeo, what's good? Jesse, Shamika, Beverly, Petrina, what's good? Juice, Queen, Boykin, Glenda, Honey, Step Up, what's good? Wild Bernie, what's good? Wave Boy, what's good? Uh, D was good. Make sure y'all share the live for your boy. Share the live for your boy. I'm gonna run down tonight. I'm gonna give y'all some information on these parasites now. All right, I'm gonna give y'all information on these parasites. Okay, I know y'all like parasites. Yeah, parasites. All right, parasites. Okay, yeah, man. I um spent mine getting over COVID. Oh, Marvet. Yo, 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 ginger root, uh, sea moss gel is on the way, so you'll be over COVID in no time, my sister. You'll be over COVID in no time. In no time. Okay? No time. Uh, Tanya Johnson, what's good? Pretty baby doll, what's good? Neo, what's good? Tony Martin, what's good? Uh, created what's good, Shadow, what's good, Dwayne Thomas, Putin, what's good, Watson, what's good, y'all come in here, do me a favor, and share the live, make sure everybody get to hear this, uh, live tonight, all right, make sure all your friends you follow, share it with them, share the live for your boy, and tap the screen, the more likes we get, the more people we can get into, the live or on to the live people. Alright? Shut a live for your boat. Shut a live. Shut a live. Shut a live for your boat. Alright.
your life for you, boy. Okay. Uh, Phoebe, what's good? Moneybag D, what's good? Coach Casey, what's good? Coco, what's good? Daniel, what's good? Pudding, what's good? Tosha, what's good? Ladies, love, glam, what's good? Happy place, what's good? What's good? What's good? Shut alive for your boy, y'all. Why well, I tell y'all about these parasites, man. Alright, it's a bunch of different kinds of parasites, but I got a couple of them for y'all tonight. I got, let me see, I mean I got, I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I got nine of them for y'all tonight. I got nine parasites for y'all tonight that we're gonna learn about, okay? Nine parasites. Okay. Shut alive for your boy. Tina, what's good? What's good, Tina? Ah, Tina, what's good? I know what y'all were thinking. I know what y'all were thinking. I know what y'all were thinking. It's 8.30. He ain't went live yet. He ain't going live tonight. I know that what y'all were thinking. I know that what y'all were thinking. I know what y'all were thinking. She said, I was going to go to bed on you. I know, I know that what y'all were thinking. I had to make sure I had everything right. I did my, uh, I just got off a live on Facebook three minutes ago. Doing the uh, live for my uh, event in North Carolina. So I've been going live on Facebook lately trying to promote that and everything. Okay, so that's why I was a little late, a little late, a little late. Okay, a little late. A little late. Debbie, what's good? I got a kale salad, Tanner baby. Kale salad. I think I got some kale in here. Some habaneros. Red peppers, orange peppers, onions. Um, and I got me some uh some roasted tomatoes. Some roasted tomatoes. I put them in the oven. They've been in there about two, three hours. Alright. I throw them in here. I got some grape seed oil on them. I mean, some olive oil on them. Key lime juice. A little bit of uh, onion powder. A little sea salt. A little cilantro. A little mango powder. This is what I've been eating the last couple of days. She say, tip tip, what's good? She said, it's 536 here. Okay, tip tip. Y'all yeah, don't know where she was at. She said her bunny was on. I woke up to you on here and now I'm going to bed with you on here. Creating the hey, everyone I'm talking about Dallas. Wake up and go to sleep a little late. Yeah, I was a little late. I've been promoting my event for North Carolina September 24th. I've been, I've been on Facebook Live today for a little bit. It was a little longer than I wanted it to be. I got off there, made sure I had to get everything right. Okay, so that's why I was a little late. I know y'all, I know y'all was, I know y'all were thinking. I, I know it. I know it. I know y'all, but he ain't getting on tonight. I know what y'all were thinking about. But I'm here. I'm here. I'm here.
He said, "Font change on your logo." Nah, I'm good on the logo. I'm good. All right, now listen to y'all. She said, "I was just fussing at you, man." See, that's what you get for fussing. That's what you get for fussing. Stop fussing. Listen. Um. She said, "Oh, so that's how we get the banner in the back." You been boozy for your Facebook fam. Okay, okay. What you mean get the banner in the bag? What you talking about? Get the banner in the bag. No, this is my actual banner. That's mine. I just got it up. This is mine. I bought this. I, I got this made. I bought this. That's mine right there. Yeah, that's mine. I got that made. When I when I go to my pop up shop, I have been handing up for like a week now. Marvet, I mean uh 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 uh, uh money bag D. Um, Craig Edmund Snow. I ain't never seen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've been had it up for about a uh, good week or now. Uh, Monday. back. Uh, I asked you about shingles earlier. You suggest, yeah, clean your blood, clean your colon, uh, applying sea moss gel to to the shingles on your skin. I right, do the, do all that. Miss Barber, what's good? What's good, Miss Barbara? What's good? Natural Lena, what's good? Kevin Williams, what's good? Do me a favor, y'all, and share the live for your boy. Share the live for your boy. Alright? Miss Barbara, what's been going on with you? I got your uh I got your uh mango sea mouth gel. I got it made up. I just gotta I just gotta feel your uh your herbs out and your order gone tomorrow, me Bobby. Oh, they're right. Today is uh Kiana's birthday. Kiana, today is Kiana's birthday. Somebody get Kiana and get Ebony on the live right now. Somebody get Kiana and Ebony on the live right now. Somebody get Kiana and Ebony on the live right now. This is how you order. This the website right here. Hit my TikTok bio. All right. Hit that link tree. Go to the website or just type in this website right here. Somebody get Kiana and get Ebony in here right now. You invited her already. Okay. Okay. That's how you order. Listen, you see, you read, you read that, um, read the whole board now. You see where it say order herbal infused sea mouth gel and get a free lawn cleanse from 92 to 99. If you want to get a free lawn cleanse, Tony, order some herbal infused sea moss gel. That means it got dandelion, ginger root, burdock, bladder rat, susperilla root, herbs. It'll say herbal infused Sea moss gel. Order that, you get a free lawn cleanse, all right? From 9 2 to 9 9. Today is what? 9 6. So you got three more days of a free lawn cleanse, all right? Three more days. Today is, uh, she said, I started the colon and the gut tea. I'm going to tough it out. Oh, yeah, it's, it's whooping up on you, ain't it, Tina? It's whooping up on you, ain't it? That's what it do to you. It it it, it, hey, it separate the, the, the girl from the women. Separate the girl from the women. 
He said, I'm going to, uh, yeah, yeah. If you order the uh, herbal infused sea moss gel, you get uh, uh, free long cleanse tea. Ton it, all right? If, uh, if, uh, let me, let me invite Kiana. Today her birthday. So she what, 20, 20 what? 23, 22, one of them? Something like that. She's something like that. 21, 22, 23, something like that. She's something like that. I know they said, oh, it's nine. Trey ain't getting on. I know that's what y'all said. Talking about me like a dog. Talking about me like a dog. I know y'all will. Talking about me like a dog. Just talking about me like a dog. Let me get Ebony in here too. Talking about me like a dog. I'm I'm froze. I'm still froze. Hold on. Somebody might be calling me. Let me see. Who getting on my nerve tonight? Who getting on my nerve? Alright. I know how y'all do. Talking about your boy. Y'all talk about me behind my back. I know how y'all do me. Oh, it probably is. She probably is out doing some. She ain't got no business. She probably is out doing some. She ain't got no business. That's probably what she doing. You right about that, Renata. You right about that. You right about that. She probably is out doing some. She ain't got no business. Well, we'll see tomorrow. We'll see tomorrow what she doing. We'll see tomorrow what she doing. It's her birthday. So she get a little pass today. All right? Here, Gina Johnson, what's good, Gina? Listen, parasites, man. Okay? We're talking about parasites, y'all. Make sure y'all get y'all some uh, some fruit or something. Now, look, man, hey, me reading about these parasites, I just want to eat salads all day. So I've been eating me. I done ate a whole thing of kale today. Whole thing. She said, that don't mean she doing anything she ain't no been doing. Hey, all I'm saying is, uh, you know, she get a pass. It's her birthday. It's her birthday, you know, so she get a pass. She probably out doing something she ain't got no business, but she get a pass. They her birthday. Right? Parasites, y'all. Listen. Parasites. Okay, I got nine of them. I'm going to tell you about nine different kinds. Oh, there she is. There she go. There she go. There she go. They said you talk about the devil, it'll show up, Keanu. They said talk about the devil and the devil will show up. We were just talking about you. We were just talking about you. We were just talking about you, Keanu. We said Kiana is out doing something she got no business doing. That's what we said. We were talking about you. I was talking about you anyway. I was talking about you. I was talk I told him Kiana out doing something she got no business. I said somebody send her an invite, get her on the live. It's her birthday. Alright, so we can send you some uh some some birthday money today. Shoot the cash out, Kiana. Shoot the cash out so we can send you some birthday money, Kiana. I ain't gonna ask your ass four or five times now. Shoot the cash out so we can get you some birthday money. I ain't gonna beg you now. I ain't gonna beg your ass now. Tana Baby was the main one talking about you was Tana Baby. Don't hey, listen. Tana Baby was the main one that said you was out doing something you ain't had no business doing. She was the main one. Her, Debbie, and uh, somebody else. Willasia, what's good? Daniel, what's good? She 
She's about to why you lying. Hey, <laughs> I'm just, I'm just, I'm just. She's about to for real. Listen, what the all? Uh, Ebony, what's good? Kiana, shoot the. Oh wait, 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 wait. She says Kiana Walker six. I'll say Kiana ain't gonna bang your ass now. Kiana Walker six. Let me send you some birthday money now. I ain't gonna bang your ass now. I ain't gonna beg your ass, man. I ain't gonna beg your ass. Kiana Walker, six. K, K I O N A. Dollar sign K I O N A. The Walker, six. All right. Alright. Happy birthday. I'ma put happy new year. Happy new year. You 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 turn you turn what? You turn 22? 21? Uh, you ain't but about 20. How old you turn, Kiana? You ain't but about 18, 19. I I sent you some birthday money, Kiana. I sent it to you. I sent it to you. 22 years old. She 22. She talking about some, I know it, I was in, he didn't know it. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. She 22. What going on with my thing? Keep on jumping off. What you say, Ebony? What you just say, Ebony? I, my, my, my computer jumped off when I was trying to read your comment. It say, uh... She talking about, y'all made the rest of my day. Who made who made the first part of the day? If we made the rest of the day, who made the first part of the day? She talking about, because you lied on me, that's why. <laughs> 22, I've been that before. Now, look at y'all reminiscing on 22. Y'all way past 22. You ain't no, you ain't going back to 22. So you might well stop thinking about it. Y'all might well stop dreaming about being 22. Yes, closer to a hundred than year 22. Oh. Uh, oh, uh, what am I to say? Dang, I see you enough to remember. Ebony, what you saying? Look, listen to that, Debbie. I tell you the truth. Tell my son, you been acting up since that date the other night. Boy, I tell y'all the truth. I tell y'all the truth. She didn't remember her. Oh, she didn't know her. She didn't know her cash out. Yeah, yeah. See, this see, she tell my son, we made the rest of her day. Who made the first part of the day? Who made the first part of the day? Who 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 made the first part of the day? And what I want to know. Who made the first part of the day? Ebony, what y'all do? What y'all do today? You damn right. I'm I'm asking questions. How y'all do me now? I don't want to hear that shit. I don't want to hear that shit. Mama just called, interrupting the live. She's talking about, I'm on with the other fam. Get on. I want to know who made the other part of the day. Uh, neat, neat, uh, Anita. I got your CMOS on the way. All right. I got your CMOS on the way. Sunshine, bless up. What's good? Look, she done went back and hide in there. She hide real good, don't she? She all right for a 22-year-old. She know how to hide, don't she? She know how to hide, don't she? You know what? All right, we're going on, y'all. We're going on. We're going to let her hide. Cynthia Just, what's good, Cynthia? Today was uh, Kiana's birthday. September the 4th was Miss Donna's birthday. Miss Donna, she, uh, you know, she probably sleep right now. She probably could stay up no longer than wait on me. So she probably sleep. Mid-daughter probably sleep. 
So we'll catch her, you know. She'll come tomorrow, that's gonna be her ass. That's, she gonna she just gonna just gonna be her ass. Alright. How long C Mouse good in the freezer bag? Oh, it's good for until you all uh, I say probably about like you leave it in there for probably about like shit. About, about two, three weeks. So you get ready to use it, it should be good. All you gotta do is throw it in the bl uh, let it let it unthaw a little bit, throw it in the blender, a little water, do its thing. You preserve it a little bit longer when you put it in the uh, freezer like that. So it's gonna it's gonna add about two weeks, three weeks until the shelf life. Shelf life forty five days. So you put it in the freezer two three weeks. Ah, right, you be good. Then you start to use it. Blend it up, you still got four to five days on it when you start to, you know, do its thing. Okay? You wanna order did do you already got some Tina, you already got a uh 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 a bunch of sea balls, don't you? Yeah, I I would say uh, oh you wanna get that free lawn cleanse? I got you. I got you, Tina. I got you, I got you, I got you, I got you. You wanna get that, I got you, I got you. I got you. You could just, you could all, uh, you could just, you could just wait. And then you order it. Then I got you. And I got you. I got you. Say Nana, what's good? Pam Designs, what's good? All right, y'all. I'm going to tell y'all about these parasites, man. All right? I'm going to tell y'all about these parasites. Tell y'all about these parasites. I'm going to tell y'all about, who, what Nene say? Uh, me too. Lawn clean. Um, I already sent your sea moss, uh, Nita. Uh, it's already on the way to you. It's already on the way to you. All right, here we go, y'all. Here we go, y'all. Here we go. All right. You want some of what, Miss Barbara? What you want, Miss Barbara? Will y'all let me? Will y'all let me get on the parasites, please? Will y'all let me? Y'all ain't gonna let me do that shit. Will y'all let me, please? Five seven broth was good. Should I be taking in more than one tablespoon of sea moss per day? Uh, yeah, yeah. You could do three tablespoons a day. That's good. Me, I do a matter of fact. Now nah, I'm gonna I'm just wait. I'm gonna just wait. I, I don't, I don't, I don't count. I don't count tablespoons. I just, I just take it. I take a lot of it a day. I drink. I did a whole. I, I, I just do it a lot. I, I do it a lot. Three is good. Three is good. She talking about some. You the one who came in late night. You rushing up. I ain't rushing you. I'm just saying. Stop talking so I can talk. Listen to me. Okay, listen. Parasites. Okay, parasites. Wait a minute, let me go down. Okay, it say parasites thrive off of trauma. Okay, you hitting home, me, Barbara? All right, parasites thrive off of trauma and toxicity, and a dirty gut and a dirty body. Okay, parasites, if they in your small intestines. Okay, they force you to eat sweet. Depending on where the parasites are in the body, it'll force you to make toxic choices. Okay, if the parasites is in the small intestines, it force you to eat sweets. If parasites in the large intestines, it force you to eat uh, food that keep you constipated or backed up, like bread and meat and starch. Okay. If parasites in your kidneys, it force you to eat salty foods or food that's high in sodium. Okay? So if you like anything that's got like a high amount, of, like uh, ramen noodles, high amount of sodium. So feeding your kids ramen noodles, your kids probably got parasites because they love them noodles. All right? Anything that's high in sodium, any kind of salty food, parasites in your kidneys. Okay? If it's in your lungs, it'll force you to cough 
or to force you to smoke tobacco. Okay? If it's in your liver, it'll force you to be angry and easily irritated, making the blood boil in the liver. Okay? If it's in the brain, it'll cause you to disobey your intuition or overlook your intuition and listen to what we call the little voice in your head. All right, the little voice in your head that tell you do the wrong shit. Okay, if parasites is in your brain, it'll cause you to overlook your gut feeling, your intuition. Okay. Um, parasites come from within the body, the same way that fruit flies come from within the fruit. Okay. Um, number one parasite. Number one parasite. It's called a fluke worm. A fluke worm or a canker worm. F-L-U-K-E. Okay? These worms are found in the bile ducts or in the liver. Okay? So they will cause a enlarged liver or inflammation in the liver. Okay? They will cause diarrhea. They will cause eczema. They will cause allergies. They will cause abdominal pain. Okay? I already told you, if you got allergies, then that means you got a bad amount or a unbalanced amount of bad bacteria. It's your bad bacteria is way up here. Your good bacteria is way down here. All right? Bad bacteria means you got toxicity. You got dirt you got filth so this is this allow fluke worms or parasites to live in your gut or in your bile ducts or in your liver okay cause you to have diarrhea in your colon okay um they call they cause eosinophilia eosinophilia which causes allergic reactions or adrenal conditions or skin disorders or endocrine, 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 however you say it, disorders, okay? Autoimmune disorders or tumors, okay? All right? Fluke worms. These worms is found in your bile ducts. Or in your liver, okay? These worms come from animal meat or animal flesh. These worms come from animal meat or animal flesh. And they and, and they got they go through an evolution stage, almost like a baby. Like from a zygote to an embryo to alright, to a, uh, a little baby, to a fetus, then to a you know, you know how you know the process of the baby. Alright? Same way how these worms go. They start and the small. They, they start out small. The bigger they get, they, they, they start to eat on you and eat on cells, and they and they cause all right all different kind of diseases. Okay, um, again, they cause enlarged livers. If your liver is enlarged, we know that is inflammation, diarrhea. That's 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 problems in the gut and the colon. Give you a runny gut, runny colon. All right. Eczema, allergies, abdominal pain. They cause eosinophilia, which cause allergic reactions in the gut. Adrenal conditions, skin conditions, endocrine disorders, autoimmune disorders or tumors. Okay? Fluke worms. The next one is called hook worm. Hook worm. H O O K, hookworm. These worms live or reside in the digestive tract or in the intestines. Okay? These worms can cause intestinal cancer. When the worms cause cancer, that means that the worm is actually eating the cells. It's eating the cell, okay? And it's depleting. Oxygen depleting iron from the cell. Anytime 
any of your cells got a lack of oxygen or a lack of iron or disease appear. All right, whatever organ or you know within your body, if if an organ is lacking oxygen, if an organ is lacking iron, if an organ is lacking iron phosphate, a disease is gonna appear in that specific spot. Okay, so if it's Lungs, if it's if it's your uh your lungs is gonna be bronchitis and your bronchial your tubes is gonna be bronchitis. Same way, just like I say, inflammation in the bronchial your tubes. Inflammation is letting you know that it's an infection right there. That's why you got chronic inflammation. So if it's uh inflammation accumulated in the bronchial your tube, all right, you know that that's a bed for the worm to live. That's a bed for it to live. Cause it's dirty. Okay? If if you got uh if it's in your alveoli sacs, that's pneumonia. Okay? So whatever that oxygen is depleted in a specific organ, that's the disease. Alright? That's how you determine what disease is what. Because a organ is deprived of oxygen. Whatever organ is deprived of the most oxygen, that's the disease you got. It could be heart disease. It could be liver disease. It could be kidney disease. It could be, you know, whatever. It could be blindness. It could be cataract. It could be tinnitus. It could be whatever. All right? It's deprived of oxygen. That's why That's why sarsaparilla root is a good one. Burdock root is a good one. Elderberry is a good one. Because it's going to give you back iron. It's going to give you back phosphate. That's, that's oxygen. All right, CO2. Um, hookworms. These worms reside in your digestive tract or in your intestines, causing intestinal cancer and can cause anemia or lack of iron. Okay? Lack of iron, all right? Tapeworm. I know y'all heard about tapeworms. I know because when I was little, my grandma used to say, damn, boy, how you eat all that food? You but got tapeworm. Damn, boy, you so greedy. You eat all that food? You but got tapeworm. All right? We joke about it. We make, we make fun of it. We make jokes about it, all right? But it's a real thing. It's a real thing. Now, listen, this how they, this is how you find them now. Listen to this. Listen to this right here. Now, this is how you find them. Okay, tapeworms is found in your stool. They lay egg fragments. The worms actually lay eggs in your doo-doo. The way how a doctor can tell if you got tapeworms, they test your feces. They make you doo-doo in a cup and run through a lab. If, if, your, if, if the feces got egg fragments in it, they, they know you got tapeworms. All right, this how this how they figure this out. Okay, so tapeworms is found in your stool. They lay egg fragments, damaging organs and tissues. All right, these worms can block the intestines, cause a constipation, block the pancreatic ducts, all right, prevent insulin flow and cause diabetes. These worms can cause pain in the abdomen, can cause nausea, can cause vomiting, it can cause a loss of appetite. Take worms. Okay? Take worms. Okay? Take worms. All right? Uh, the next worm is called, number four, is called hammerhead worm. Hammer. Head worm. Alright? Hammerhead. Let me get my let me get my thing right, y'all. My computer right. It's tripping over here. Alright. The next one is called hammerhead worm. 
Yeah, it's no need to be scared of the, of the worms. Listen, if if you allow the worm to stay in you, this this mean disease can appear. So everybody, me, everybody done had these worms. Okay? We just been taught all wrong. Okay? We've been taught all wrong. We've been taught wrong. Okay? If they just tell us eating this damn meat will cause parasites and this parasite is going to eat away at your cells and going to eat your iron and eat your oxygen and going to cause you to have, all right, we probably would be more prone to get off of the damn meat. All right? So it ain't nothing to be scared of. All right? And again, like I told you, another way that you can find out that you passing parasites is if you got anal itch. I know y'all don't bitch in the bathroom, you use the bathroom, and then sometimes your butthole be itching, and you sometimes you want to scratch it. It be itching, sometimes you want to scratch it. All right? That's an anal itch. It's itching. That means you could be passing a parasite. Parasite is trying to leave your gut, trying to leave your intestines because you cleaning it out. You cleaning it out by eating you know, kale salad, you know, fruit, drinking your herbal tea. If your if your if your if your butthole be itching, all right, that's called anal itch. That's good. That's good. That means you could possibly be done past the parasite. Cause parasite is trying to get away from the cleanliness of your intestines. They're trying to they're trying to run. They're trying to go to some dirt, trying to go to some filth. That's where they want to go. Alright? Oh. Uh, hammerhead worm. Alright? Hammerhead worm. Alright? As long as you cleaning your cleaning out. Yeah. As long as you cleaning your body out, the parasites won't, they, they will not live in there. They, they, they can't. They thrive off toxicity. They thrive off of Chronic inflammation, they thrive off of infection. Okay? That's why, uh, uh, you know how women say, some women, they say discharge is normal. No. No. You probably got signs of trick. Trichonomia, whatever they call it. Trich Trichonomomias, however, they, however you say it. All right, if you discharge some green fluids, all right, something going on, baby. Something going on, baby. I'm sorry. Something going on. Okay? Something going on. If you discharge it, any kind of talk about some, well, I, my pen supposed to have a, it supposed to have some, no, it ain't. No, it ain't. No. All right, I'm, I'm going to get to that. 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 All right? I'm going to get to that. I'm going to get to that. Hammerhead worms, Okay? These worms, hammerhead, releases a neurotoxin that immobilizes the body and they cause skin irritation. Okay? They call these worms carnivorous hammerhead. Alright? Carnivorous hammerhead. Okay? They like to eat on you. Come from meat. Alright? Come from meat. Red meat. Beef, pork, uh, bacon, steak, oh you no, know, all this. They call it carnivorous hammerhead. And this 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 is the kind of worm that you can't you can't kill it. Like you can't chop his head off. I right? it'll rejuvenate in like two weeks. It's actually got a head like a hammer. That's why they call it hammerhead worm. Okay? You can't you can't chop his head off. It'll rejuvenate. All right, in like two weeks. Hammerhead worm. It releases a neurotoxin that immobilizes the body. Whatever, if a neuro, if a uh, hammerhead is in a, you know, wherever it's at, it releases this neurotoxin to immobilize the prey that it's trying to feed on. So if it's in your, if it's in you, it releases the neurotoxin to immobilize you. Then it start to eat on your cells. Start to cause you to be, you got them just be, you just be, you just, you just got them just, you got it all. You be like, boy, what the hell? You just itching like a mother. You just, 
You just scratching like a mother, okay? Hammerhead worms. All right, hammerhead. All right, hammerhead. Listen, the next worm, number five, is called, it's called Fasciolopis, Fasciolopis Booski. All right, not, not, not a Booski, not your boyfriend Booski, not your boyfriend Booski. All right, this is a worm, Fasciolopsis Booski, not your boyfriend Booski. All right. Not your boyfriend, Booski. All right? Uh, this worm was called Fasciolopsis Booski. It get into your bloodstream. Okay? It started to eat iron or oxygen. Okay? And it caused leukemia. It can cause leukemia. Okay? All right, it gets to your bloodstream. Remember, I told you, leukemia is a disease of the blood. When your blood is lacking oxygen or lacking iron. All right, that's why that's why elderberry is good for that. Okay, so this this worm called Booski, when it get into the bloodstream, it starts to eat this iron and eat this phosphate and eat this oxygen. It can cause leukemia, which is a cancer of the blood. Okay, if it started to bite off chunks of the cells and eat oxygen, they call it sickle cell. If it started to bite your cell and eat your cell away, remember your cell is a whole cell. It started to bite in this cell, all right, and it only leave a sickle of a cell. This is us. This is what we call sickle cell, cause it's a sickle. It ain't a whole cell no more. It's a sickle of a cell. This is why they call it sickle cell. All right, this worm called Fasciolopsis Booski, when it start to bite off chunks of the cells and start to eat oxygen, it cause it cause a uh, sickle cell. Okay, it causes sickle cell. If it travel to the heart, I right, congestive heart failure, heart disease. All right. If it goes to the thymus gland and start to eat the T cells or the B cells, now we start to call that HIV or full blown AIDS, all right? Autoimmune deficiency syndrome, okay? If this worm caused Booski, if it travels to the thymus gland, okay, and start to eat the T cells or the B cells, we call that HIV or full blown AIDS. Okay? If this worm Booski travel to the pancreas and start to eat the island of Langerhans, okay, we call that diabetes. Okay? Okay? We call that diabetes. Okay? Fasciolopsis. F-A-S-C-I-O-L-O-P-S-I-S. Fasciolopsis. F-A-S-C-I-O-L-O-P-S-I-S. Booski. B-U-S-K-I. B-U-S-K-I. Fasciolopsis Booski. Yes, she said we get dog deworm and we need to be deworm. Absolutely. Absolutely, Keon. Absolutely. Yes, ma'am. 100%. Yes, ma'am. 100%. 100%. We the one that need to be getting deworm. We don't want you to be getting dewormed. Yes, ma'am. All right. You got that money bag? Fasciolopsis Booski. You got that one? 
right? Remember now, if it get into the bloodstream, it'll cause leukemia or cause cancer. If it starts to bite off chunks of the cells, all right, it can cause sickle cell. If it travels to the heart, congestive heart failure, heart disease. If it goes to the thymus gland and eat the T cells or the B cells, HIV or full-blown AIDS. If it makes it to the pancreas and, and start to eat the island of Langerhorn, which is the which is the foundation, which is the core of the pancreas, which 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 is produces insulin. Alright, we call that diabetes. Okay. Alright, the next worm is called Helminth. H-E-L-M-I-N-T-H. Helminth worm. Helminth worms. H-E-L-M-I-N-T-H. Okay? H-E-L-M-I-N-T-H. Helminth worms. Alright? These worms showcase themselves by causing the flu. Alright? The flu, y'all. The flu. Say these worms showcase themselves by the flu or muscle aches or skin rashes. Okay, more chronic infections are residing in the liver, in the lungs, in the bladder. In the intestines and the brain. Okay. This can cause you to have. Liver. Disease. Lung disease. A problem with the bladder. Intestinal disease. And brain disease. Like schizophrenia. Or, or, or Alzheimer's. Or, 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 or you know. You go crazy and shit in the brain. Alright, these worms feed on blood, which cause you to lose iron. Okay? Okay? Hell minute worms. They showcase themselves by the flu or muscle aches or skin rashes. More chronic infections. Okay, reside in the liver, the lung, the bladder, intestines, or the brain. These worms feed on blood, which cause you to lose iron. Anytime you lose iron and oxygen, all right, a disease will appear in that specific organ, in a specific spot. Okay? Uh, It's a kale salad. Halo. Alright. The next worm is called Toxioplasma gundi. The next worm is called Toxioplasma gundi. G-O-N-D-I-I. -I, or gundi. Toxioplasma gundi. Or gundi. However you want to say it. All right, it say these gun die worms can lead to blindness, cataracts, or glaucoma. If the immune system is weakened, these worms can cause seizures, which is an infection in the brain, and many other brain illnesses. These worms typically found in AIDS patients can lead to a fatal death. Okay? Also, they can, uh, in diabetes, diabetic retinopathy. All right? 
These worms can be found in the kidney, the bladder, and the intestines. Signs of Toxioplasma gundi worms. Signs of Toxioplasma, T-O-X-I-O, -O, Plasma, Gundi, G-O-N-D-I-I. -I. All right, money bag, you got that? <clears> T-O-X-I-O, -O, Plasma, G-O-N-D-I-I. -I. Okay. Um, signs are swollen lymph nodes. All right, headache, fever, inflammation in the lung, inflammation in the heart. Okay. Toxioplasma gun die. All right. Now this is right here. It's called uh, trichomonas. However you say it, trich, trichomonas. However you say it, y'all know what I'm talking about. Vaginalis, uh, vaginalis, trichomonia, vaginalis, uh, vaginalis, uh, vaginalis. However you say that shit. All right, vaginalis. Okay, trich, T R I C. O M O N I A S I S. Listen, trick, trick, trichomonious. However you say that shit. Vaginalis. All right. T R I C H O M O N I A S I S. V A G I N A L I S. Vaginalis. <laughs> Vaginalis. Okay. All right. Okay. They call it trick. I, I, I'm, I, I, I know. Back in the day, you know, it, it used to be girls that used to, they used to give. Uh, I, I, I remember, I remember vividly. Like sometimes my cousin would be like. They'll be, they be talking about some girls. Some girls gave some dudes some tricks. And I remember this vividly. I didn't know what it was then. But now I know. Trick. Vaginalis. Okay. Uh, I'm going to post it on YouTube, Tina. I got you, Tina. I got you. Trick is called by parasite. Absolutely. That's why the parasite name is Trichomonius. Vagin vaginalis. It's called trichomonas vaginalis. I spread it for you. V a g i n a l i s. Vaginalis. That's the name of the worm. Vaginalis. All right. All right. Trichomonas vaginalis. All right, it say <clears throat> this parasite infects the vagina and the urethra in women and men. Okay, it resides in the vagina where infection is, or in the prostate or in the urethra, which is responsible for peeing for the man. Okay. This parasite, if a woman got tricked, if a man got tricked, okay? If a woman got it, then you know she got parasites in the vagina where the infection lie at. So again, if you if, if you ever heard, I you know, it, to today, you know, people that's not on this type of natural healing, they think it's normal for a woman to have discharge. Discharge means it is a infection. Okay? Infection in the vagina. I'm going to say it to you one more time. This parasite infects the vagina. 
okay, and the urethra, okay? It resides in the vagina where infection is located or in the prostate, okay? All right, so you can call it what you want to call it. You can say discharge. You can say my doctor said it was okay. You can say all. You can say all that. You can say what you want to say. All right. The truth is, the parasite called Trichomonas vaginalis. I say vaginalis. I know. I know that. I know that ain't the word. But I say vaginalis. That's how it's easy for me to say. Vaginalis. Okay. You nine times out of ten, you probably got trick. If you go to the doctor and you get you a test for trick. It's probably going to come back a little positive, okay? Especially if you got some discharge coming out of you. You're talking about it's, 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 you know, it's normal, okay? All right? Okay? All right? Um, The other word, which is called Trinidad worms. Trinidad worms. This is also a worm that resides in the vagina. Guess what it calls, though, y'all? Guess what it calls? It calls chlamydia. And it calls gonorrhea. Trinidad worms. T-R-I-N-I-D-A-D. Like Nicki Minaj, Trinidad. And she was Trinidad. All right. Trinidad worms. All right. These worms reside in the vagina. All right. Or in the male urethra. Okay. Then these cause chlamydia and gonorrhea. Okay. Which is going to cause you to shoot up all this green stuff, which is going to be infection. Okay. All right. Okay. So again. Okay. Again. Let me let me let me let me let me stuff for the top and give y'all these worms now. One more time. Fluke worms. Alright. Fluke worms. It's gonna be found in your bile ducts or in your liver. Alright. They can cause allergic reactions, adrenal conditions, skin disorders. Endocrine disorders, autoimmune disorders, and tumors. Hookworms. These worms reside in the digestive tract or in the intestines. They can cause intestinal cancer. Okay? And can cause anemia or lack of iron. Take worms. They found in your stool. Now they lay eggs. Okay? They can cause, uh, they block the intestines. Causing constipation. They block the pancreatic ducts to prevent insulin flow, which causes you to be diabetic. Okay? Can cause you to vomit. Can cause nausea. Okay? Hammerhead worm. This worm releases a neurotoxin to immobilize its prey. So if it's in you, it releases this toxin to immobilize you so it can eat your ass. All right, and cause skin irritation. So if you got the itchies, if you you just somebody you always scratching and you got all this old dead ugly looking skin, because all you do is just scratch. All you do is just scratch. You just scratch. Your skin is why are you scratching. All right, because you got a hammerhead. Okay, they call it carnivorous hammerhead. Okay, they call it carnivorous hammerhead worm. All right, the next worm. Fasciolopsis Booski. Not your boyfriend Booski, but the worm Booski. Okay? It get into the bloodstream. Okay? It can cause cancer of the blood, which is called leukemia. Alright? If it start to bite off chunks of your cell, it's going to cause you to get sickle cell. If it travel to your heart, it's going to cause you heart disease. If it travels to your thymus gland, okay, 
It's going to eat your T cells or your B cells. And we call that HIV or full blown autoimmune deficiency syndrome. If it make it to the pancreas and start to eat the core of the pancreas, which is called the islet of Langerhans, I, you're going to be diabetic. Fasciolopsis. Booski. Okay? Helminth worms. H-E-L-M-I-N-T-H. Worms. These worms showcase themselves by the flu. Or muscle aches. Or skin rashes. More chronic infections of these worms. Is residing in the liver. Which is going to cause liver issues. In the lung, it's going to cause lung issue. In the bladder, going to cause bladder issue. In the intestine, called intestinal issue. In the brain, which going to cause you to go crazy. All right? Or any kind of brain issue. These worms feed on the blood, which cause you to lose iron or oxygen, which make you become anemic. Okay? The next worm is called Toxioplasma gundi. These worms is responsible for blindness, cataracts, and glaucoma. All right, if the immune system is already weakened, all right, these worms can cause seizures and many other brain illnesses. Okay? These worms typically are found in AIDS patients and can lead to fatal death. Okay? These worms can also be found in the kidney and the bladder and the intestines. Now, some signs of this worm is swollen lymph nodes or lymph glands, headaches, fevers, inflammation in the lung, inflammation in the heart. All right? Trichonomius vaginalis. Okay? This worm is called the trick vagina worm. The trick vaginalist worm is what we're going to call it. Trick vaginalist. Okay? This parasite infects the vagina and the penis. Okay? It resides in the vagina where infection lay at or in the prostate. Okay? So if you're a man and you can't, you, if you if you shoot blanks, it's pro if you shoot blanks without having a hysterectomy, all right, brother, you got uh, parasites in your prostate, which causes you not to be able to produce this semen. This is where your semen starts to produce that. In the, that's why you gotta have a good prostate in order to shoot your shoot your skeet skeet how you want to skeet skeet. You gotta have a good prostate because your your semen travel through the seminal vesicle. It gotta go through this alkaline fluid. This alkaline fluid is in this prostate. It travel through this, then it goes down, and it come to the the penis where it get ready to shoot out. All right. Once it get to the penis, we call that uh 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 um uh damn. It's a name for it. It's called some ejaculation where well, you can't stop it. It's called um uh, damn. I forget the word. It's something ejaculation. Well, you can't stop. You can't stop the ejaculation from coming. You can't stop it from coming. It's called uh, damn. Uh, mm, mm, mm. I can't think of it. But anyway, once once the once the sperm get to the to the penis, I right, you can't stop it from coming. So as a man, you you would you would you would know what I mean as a man. Sometimes when you be with a girl and you ain't ready to come yet, all right, you, you'll stop for a minute to reset yourself, then go back again. But if it ever get to a certain spot, you know ain't shit you can do to stop it. Ain't shit you can do. You can try to squeeze. You can try to hold. You can try to squeeze. You can try to whatever. You, you don't matter what you, you're going to. So you just, if you feel it coming, uh, you know, you just better go ahead on it and, and just do what you do. And you let it come, all right? You can't stop it. All right, you can't stop it. When it get to a certain point, you can't stop it, 
All right. Um. So, if you got problem with your prostate, you got problems. You know, shooting semen. All right. You probably got this parasite called vaginalis trick vaginalis. All right. Trinidad worms. Trinidad worms is going to cause you chlamydia and gonorrhea, which is also going to cause this infection to show in the penis or in the vagina. Okay? Trinidad worms. All right? So, again, a man with a fat, extra, big old belly, imagine how many worms he got. He'll he a cesspool for, just full of just worms. A man with a big old belly, just worms everywhere. Stool backed up, constipated. I, right? you know, he's so backed up, it's ridiculous. He used the bathroom, it'll take him months. Without detoxing the body properly, it'll take him the rest of his life to be able to, to, to just, you know, get rid of. All the bullshit that's in him. Alright. The darker that your feces is. It lets you know it sat in your body. For a long time. Okay. The darker that the feces is. That means it sat in your body. For a longer period of time. So if you got black. It been in there for a long time. Dark, dark, dark brown. It been in there for a minute. Alright. So your, your boo-boo should be kind of like a light color, like a light brownish or something. That means it didn't waste no time. Alright? It didn't waste no time. You like, like I'll eat this kale salad. When I get off live, I'll probably go to the bathroom. Alright? That's because it, it's going through me. When I eat this kale like this right here. Alright? My body take this kale. And you the nutrients from it. Okay? When my body get done using the nutrients and the kale and the onions and the pepper and the tomato, you don't need it no more. Like now, I just swallowed it. So now my body gonna start to use it. Going down. I can feel it. I can feel it now. Move. I can feel it moving down. My body gonna take it and use it for its nutrition. When my body get done using it for nutrition, it don't need it no more. So it gonna it's, it gonna it gonna it's waste. It gonna get rid of. It. So I gotta go to the bathroom to get this waste out of me. But this is a quick process, though. This is a quick process. All right. That's how that's how food work. So you eat fruit. Your body, you, you swallow it, your body say, damn, this is good nutrition. Let me use this. Wham, 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 wham. Once they use it, now I can get rid of it. I don't need it no more. I got I, I, I absorb all the good shit from it. Now I can get rid of it. Okay. Yes. Extract the nutrients and spare the waste. Absolutely. 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 When I eat, uh, like I said, I've been eating kale for the last, what, three days? And listen, when you go to the bathroom, you see the kale in the toilet. Well, when I go to the bathroom, I see kale in the toilet. I see kale. I be like, damn, I should have never kale. Ain't never kale. Never kale. All right? But that's how it's supposed to be. That's how it's supposed to be. All right? Okay? When you eat good and you eat clean, all right, you ain't got to be shamed. You can, you can go stand around. You can be at work in a group of people and you can just start farting. Nobody will nobody never know. Nobody will never know. You can just be farting. You can just be farting. And look, and that's how I found out. That's how I found out. All right, when I first started eating alkaline and all my smoothies and cleaning out and everything, I'm at work. I'm at work at Volkswagen on the drive to Fort Lee. So a lot, so a lot of time we will just be standing around waiting. A lot of the time, standing around just waiting. So we in a little hall just talking, 
And I mess around and pass gas. So now I'm thinking to myself, I'm like, damn, they gonna smell it. So me myself, I'm trying to smell it myself. I'm trying to, I'm trying to, I'm trying to get a whiff of it first. I'm I'm like searching for it. I'm I'm trying to, I'm smelling for it. I'm like, damn. I don't smell nothing though. So I'm like, I'm gonna do it again just to make sure. I'll do it again. I'm like, I step away and then walk back. I'm like, damn. I don't smell it. And they ain't saying shit in the, in the circle. Anybody said nothing. They ain't said who fought it. They ain't said, I smell this. That, nothing. Ain't nobody said nothing. So I said, then you know what? I'm going to just start falling right here. And I'm, I don't need. So we'll be right there in the circle every day. I just be falling. Like they wouldn't even know. I'm just right there just falling. To me, it's funny. I'm just right there just laughing. I'm just laughing. I'm falling like a mug. They don't even know. But it don't stink. So, so, so that's how you do. That's how you do. That's how I do. Go to the bathroom. You don't, you don't stink. So your, your, your poop should not smell. If you go to the bathroom and your boo boo stinking, I right, you stinking. Okay? It's your boo boo. All right? If you go to the bathroom and your boo boo stinking, all right, you stink. Okay, it's simply that. It just, it just, it just simply that. It's yours. Where does it come from? Where it come from? It come from you. It come from you. All right, it come from you. Okay, so it's you. So, so you got stinking doo doo, and you had to strain to do it. And you smell like a cesspool. You got you got you got all kind of parasite. You ain't no telling what you ain't no telling what's wrong with you. Ain't no telling. Ain't no telling. Ain't no telling. Ain't no telling what's wrong with you. Ain't no telling. You probably got Trinidad worm. You probably got fasciosis this booski. You probably got all kind of you just you just full of just worms. Alright? You just pull the worms. Okay? So, I'm just telling y'all now. It might sound funny. Okay? But, if you eat meat, you need to be detoxing. You need to be on some cola cleanse tea. Like Tina is. You need to be on some, I right, need to be detoxing. You need to be getting rid of this meat you eat. You need to be on a, a kale salad. You need to be on a, uh, you need to be on some good, all right? You need to be on it. Okay? You need to be on it. Okay? Straight up, though. For real. Okay? For real. For real. I'm going to make sure I put this live um, on the uh, YouTube channel. So, make sure. Now, if y'all ain't already. All right? She said, Kale give me gas. This is cook. Now, keep on eating. Keep on eating it. You that's what you want to do. You want to be farting. Keep on eating that kale to your to to get right. You want to be farting. You want to you want to you want to be so clean to where you fart and you can just you ain't got to roll the water down. You ain't got you can just fart and just and just and that's how you want to be. All right. As a man, one of our sayings is a woman is a dime. If she can sit on the toilet and still be fine. Alright? A woman is a dime if she sit on the toilet and still be fine. One way you can sit on the toilet and be fine is if your ass ain't stinking. Alright? If you want me to be in the bathroom with your ass while you shitting, you don't need to be stinking. I don't need to be in there like this. Now, you need to at least need to be, you know, smelling, you know. You know what I'm saying? Yes. Kale is chlorophyll, yes. All right? One of the sayings is, like I said, a woman is a dime, all right, if she can sit on the toilet and still be fine. All right? One way you can do that is to not be funky. Okay? All right? Okay? That's one way. That's one way. 
She talking about, oh, I'm fine then. <laughs> ah! I'm just, I'm just saying that's some, that's that's a saying that 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 men, you know. And you know, I'm just, I'm just trying to tell you now. You know how they say when you get comfortable with your man, you get comfortable with your woman, you go to the bathroom with him and shit like that. I right, your ass in there, you stinking and shit. No, I'm not finna be up in there. You gonna have my shirt stinking and you gonna have me smelling like shit. You gonna have me. No. I need to be in there and be able to breathe. I right, be able to, you know, and, and and you do your shit. And and you know, like that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. She talking about some, I'm a dying. <laughs> she said, we should have listened that day. You asked what our attribute was. I don't stink. <laughs> she said, my girl don't even use the bathroom. My, hey, divine. Hey, so your, your girl, funk, your girl, your girl that bad? She that bad? Said she don't need you the bathroom. Now, listen, that's how you know women. That's how you know some women know they be stinking. They know it. Y'all saw that TikTok video where the girl, uh, they, 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 it's this, it's the sound they use this sound where they say, uh, you couldn't wait for the boyfriend to leave. They go and have photo dope and they just fall for like thirty seconds. They, they know they funky. If you scared to fall, if you scared, then, then, then you'll say, then you'll say, it ain't ladylike. Well, it ain't human-like to be holding your shit in to be goddamn, that ain't human-like to have to fall and holding that shit in. That ain't even human-like. You talking about ladylike. You gonna fuck up all your damn, you gonna fuck up everything trying to be pretty, trying to hold your fart in till you get home. I ain't never, I ain't never, I ain't never saw shit like it. I ain't never seen it like a day in my life. You, you got a shit. You won't go shit. You want to wait till he go home. You know, you've been holding your shit an hour. I ain't never seen it like it. I ain't never seen it like it. All right. Stop doing that shit. You know you're funky. That's why you don't want to do it. All right. Take your way to the bathroom or something. Turn the, you know, or, you know, turn the water like y'all do. Turn the water. Turn the faucet or something like y'all do or whatever. And use the goddamn bathroom. God damn it. Right, if you gotta go, you gotta go. <clears throat> to my she she shy still. I don't know why. Cause her ass thinking probably. Cause her ass thinking. Man, listen, I'm I'm going to the bathroom, bro. I'm sorry about your look. I'll be back for in a minute. Alright? I, and I ain't worried. Cause I know when I, when I leave the bathroom, I'm gonna leave the door open. Cause I know I don't, I know I ain't thinking. I'm going to the bathroom. I'm going to the bathroom. All right? And I'm going to leave the door open when I come out. Because, you know, you probably going to be like, damn, this nigga like magic or something, ain't it? His shit don't even stink. Yeah, I know. I know. I know. I know. I know. <laughs> she told me she laughed. She know, she, know her ass, she know her ass be rotting. She know her ass be rotting. She know her ass be riding. Yeah, magic. Yeah, hell yeah. Hell yeah, hell yeah. Magic, hell yeah. Hell yeah. Do you believe in magic? Hey, do you believe in miracles? You sexy thing. Yeah, I'm trying to tell y'all right now. Like I told y'all before. If the woman ain't shitting, if she ain't farting, I don't want them. I want me somebody that's shitting fart. I don't want no, I don't want no motherfucker that don't. If 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 you ain't never been around your girl when she done farting or shitting, something wrong. You don't even like, damn baby, do you even use a bath? Do you even fart? Do you even shit? I ain't never even seen you even go to the bathroom. Do you even do that? I, I don't need, I don't need to have, I don't need to, be, I don't need to be having it in my mind. I need to know that your ass is a human. Okay, I need to know that. I 
I need to know that. All right, I need to know that. I need to know that. All right. Now, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. I need to know that you use the bathroom. I, I, I need to know that. I need to know that. I need to know that. He said that's what I be saying to her. I swear. I don't know why she's so. I don't know, bro. You you know what you all do? You all just you all just busting on her ass one day, just busting on her, and just sitting there with her ass. Why she ain't gonna? If she ain't there, she she gonna get up, busting there on her and just sitting there. She will get over it. She ain't gonna she she ain't gonna get her ass up, busting there on her, just busting there on her ass and just and then shut the door, busting there on her ass and just shut the door. Do that too. He's, what what you say, money bag? Oh, so if she got a bag, you don't want her. If she got a bag, what you mean by the bag? What you mean by if she got a bag, I don't want her. What you mean by that? Cause you be, you be, you be, you be trying to talk that little slang like you 16 to 17 years old, money bag. You gotta talk that little slang and shit. Oh, them shit bags. Them shit bags. You talking about them shit bags? You talking about them colon bags? Oh shit, no. Hell no. That means she definitely stinking. If she got a bag, oh no. No, 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 you gonna miss around and have a fluke worm, fucking with them eggs. Have a fluke worm. Eggs is bad. Eggs is a chicken baby. It's a chicken baby. It's a chicken baby. That what it is. That what it is. Alright? It's gonna mess with your cholesterol. It's gonna mess with your liver. Okay? Eggs is so bad the egg industry cannot list it on the category as a health food. You can look it up. The egg industry cannot list eggs as a health food. It's that bad for your cholesterol. All right, you gonna fuck around and have a fluke worm messing with them eggs, okay? All right. All right. Par parasites cause all disease, y'all. Parasites, inflammation. Because remember, if you got inflammation or you got mucus, an uh, excess amount of mucus, this is what a parasite going to be at. If you got, if you dirty, parasites going to be there. You dirty. Mucus. Parasite, inflammation, mucus, phlegm, whatever you want to call it. This is where your disease come from. Okay? All right? What's good food for protein? Oh, uh, walnuts, Brazilian nuts, quinoa, all right, wild rice. This is what this is what we would categorize as protein. Otherwise, anything else like meat, all right, you go fuck around and have a uh, fasciolopsis booster. You go fuck around and have uh, tape worms. You go fuck around and have a uh, hammerhead worm. Fuck around and have all that trigonomia worm. All right, fuck with that meat. Fuck with that meat. You gonna have them worms.
Spring water. Spring water. Spring water. Me Bobby. The only scary part is to not remove the worm. That's the scary part. Imagine how many people walking around today eating chicken sandwiches. They, they just ate a bunch of barbecue yesterday. They just barbecue spare ribs and T-bones and yesterday. Imagine, imagine them folk walking around with all these worms and act like they shit don't stink. I'm talking about they full of all kind of just, just filthy. Just filthy. But they got on, but they got on Balenciaga though. But, but they got on, but they got on, uh, Michael Jordan's. But, but they, 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 they driving a, uh, a, a Charger though. But they ass is sick as a dog. 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 No, no parasites. The, 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 the. And when you do teas and you do kale salads and stuff, you do fruit, parasites don't like that. They're going to run away. They're going to run away. So when you use the bathroom, like I said a while ago, if you use the one, one way how you could identify that you pass them, pass the parasites, when you use the bathroom and you get anal itch, okay? If your butthole start itching when you use the bathroom, all right, that's a sign that parasites could be being passed because they're getting out of your body. They 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 running away because you're cleaning out. They don't want to be there. They don't want to be there. Okay. All right. All right. So that that's 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 y'all parasite. That's y'all parasite 101. That's Parasite 101 for y'all ass. All right? Don't worry about the brand. Just get the spring water. How do you stop the itch? Oh, uh, it'll, 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 just, it'll just stop by itself. Uh, uh, wipe the butt. Wipe the butt real good. Uh, wipe it again. Get the, you know, wipe it. You know, the, the itching let you know that you could be done past it. Okay, you know how you know you know you can't scratch it. Get some tissue, I guess you know, and just wipe it again, or you know, do it like that. Otherwise, just you know, let it, let it let it run its course. Okay, three yeah, shower three times a day yeah. You might not know toilet paper. It's not itchy because it's dirty. No, no. Look, if no, no. Look, 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 look. If you somebody that don't wipe your ass, you know, you just a dirty mother. You just dirty. All right. So your ass. So you got. So you walk around. You scratching your ass all the time. All right. You dirty. You just. A, you just. You just trifling. But I'm saying when you start to eat clean and you eat good and you bowel movements and you are doing everything good and everything. I and you put I and you, and, you, and you ain't no my you know that's what I'm saying about the ain't no itching. I right, but it won't last long because you're gonna pass them. They're gonna they're gonna you 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 you'll be okay. You'll be okay. You'll be okay. You'll be okay. Yeah, everybody know them. Y'all know what I'm talking about now. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Y'all know y'all don't grew up with somebody that was dirty as hell. Then wipe halfway wiping your ass. You walk around, you always scratching your ass. You got doodle stains in your in your tiny whitey, cause you halfway wiping your ass. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Y'all know what I'm talking about. You wanna fast. 
Oh, yeah, you, yeah, get you some wipes. Get you some, uh, you know, some, uh, some, some, uh, you know, some little soft wipes or something like that. Or some Charmin. Get you some Charmin or something like some old soft Charmin. You know, old, old delicate booty, you know. Some, sorry you know, for a delicate booty, you know. Oh, uh, listen. Papaya seeds help you pass them. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Um, uh, when you want to fast, choose your fast. You want to do a fruit fast? Go and buy you some watermelon. If that's your fruit of choice. Or buy you some mangoes. A box of them. If that's your fruit of choice. Whatever fruit you want to do, that's the fruit you need to be using. And you eat that fruit all day, every day. You drink your spring water. You get you some herbal teas. Like, uh... Like this right here, like a like a this is called an endo tea, but long clean endo blood. Get you some tea like this. Drink your tea one cup, two three times a day. And that's what you doing. You eating your fruit, drinking your water, drinking your tea all day long. All right, you gonna start the peeing. You gonna start doo dooing. You gonna this is this is your this is your body detox, and you wanna do this. Three days, five days, seven days, you know, 10 days, 12 days, all right? The longer you go, the cleaner you're going to be, all right? Did the doctor really cure a type 1 diabetic? What doctor? Yeah, the papaya seeds kind of got a little pepper. They kind of little, you know, they ain't, they ain't, they ain't. To me, the papaya ain't even good. To me, the papaya nasty to me. Okay. All right. So, so yeah. All right. And look, all of y'all new people. Okay. Make sure y'all hit my uh TikTok bio. Hit my TikTok bio. Alright. And hit that link tree. Okay. And follow me on IG. Add me on Facebook. Subscribe to the YouTube channel. You can also find my website on there too. In that link tree. Make sure you on the website. Use the coupon code. Sell food for your discount. All right. This the website right here. If you own, uh, if you if you can't, or uh, if you don't want to put it up on the link tree, type it in carbonbasedsellfood.com. All right. Uh, you the discount code sell food. All right. For your discount. Okay. Well, did he? I'm hearing that he did. What doctor you talking about? You just talking about did, did he did who? Did who? What are you talking about? White oak bark. That's good. The man cured everything. Diabetes is, was easy as hell for him. The man cured every single thing. Everything. You cure, you cure every disease the same way. Removing bad food, adding good food, doing the herbs, fasting. You do it the same way. It don't matter type 25. It could be type 1, type 5, type 10. It don't matter. All right? It don't matter. All of it got cured the same way. The same way. You cure every disease the same exact way. You take away the bad food. You add the good food with the herbs. This is how you allow your body to heal. It's the same way. It's the same way. The same way. The same way. 
It's the same way. So it ain't no... Can you read about it? Um, you could, uh, matter of fact, you could Google, um, New Amsterdam, New York News, October 1st, 1988. Google that. New York, New Amsterdam News, October 1st, 1988. It gonna show you a, a newspaper article. Click on it. It's going to say, Herbalist found not guilty. That's CB. You'll see it on there. It's, it, it's still there right now today. You can go look it up right now. You can Google that and it'll come up. Okay? For diabetes, again, all you got to do is, is eat fruit and then do you some blood cleanse tea, some soursop leaves, some mango leaves. That's all you got to do. Eat you some fruit. Eat you some watermelon. Go on your fruit fast. Watermelon, strawberry, blueberry, raspberry. Go on your fruit fast. Drink you some herbal tea. Blood cleansing tea. Get you some mango leaf. Drink some mango leaf tea. Get some soursop leaf. Drink soursop leaf tea. That's all you got to do. That's all you got to do. Um, yeah, you really just need to eat fruit until you get your A1C under control to like five. Yes, you want, yeah. I know it's hard. You could teeter-totter with salads if you want to. Like, like, like right now, I got, a, I got kale in here, mushrooms, habanero, red pepper, orange pepper, and onions. Season it up with some sea salt, cayenne pepper, cilantro, all right, mango powder. That's it. Put a little key lime juice on it with a little olive oil. And that's all I did. And I've been eating it. So, this is something that you could eat, you know, if you get tired of fruit. That's all you need to do. <clears throat> How about the tea? The tea come in, the, the tea come like this right here. It come in bags like this. It's like $20. You can buy as many of them as you want. The teas come in bags like this. A blood cleanse tea. You can buy these as many as you want. Okay? Blood cleanse. If you want to clean your blood, get a blood cleanse tea. You want to help your lungs, Get a lawn cleanse tea. Help your liver. Get a liver clean. Kidney. Kidney cleanse. All right? It's on the website. Link in the bio. Oh, uh, listen. Miss Seven. Seven Bless. Listen. You order these herbs. I send you a list. Of uh, you know, you know, a blood you are a blood cleanse tonic, right? You need blood cleanse tonic and mango leaves. That's what you need. Sea moss gel won't hurt you. Okay. Uh I send you a paper with the ingredients on it. Show you what's in your blood cleanse and what it's good for. Drink that tea, that blood cleanse tea, drink that tea. One cup, two, three times a day. Okay? Stay on your fruit. I know it. I know it can get difficult. Alright? I know it can. So if you want to just teeter totter back and forth between fruits and vegetables, like 
Forever Evolve and said, get you some seaweed wrap. Make you some wraps with, you know, lettuce and, you know, eat you some wraps or something like that. But no cooked food. You don't need no cooked food right now while you healing. You want your body to use this energy to heal, not digest food. Okay? That's what you want to do. Make sure you come back on this live tomorrow and every day while you're healing. So if you got questions, we can just walk you through it. Okay? Make sure you come back on this live. Oh, my salad, kale, white mushrooms sliced up, onions, red peppers, orange peppers, habanero peppers, I. Sea salt, onion powder, little cayenne, little mango powder, little cilantro. Put me a little olive oil on it, squeeze me a key lime on it. And that's all I did. That's all I did. All right. Yeah. Raw mushroom, yeah. Hey, Rob. Hey, Rob. Yeah, they raw. They raw. Uh, Miss Seven Bless, make sure you come back on the live now and let us know every single day now. All right, come on back. So if you got questions, we can just walk you through it. Yeah, the, the little sliced white mushroom, the little button mushroom, the little white ones in the stove, they easy to find. They easy to find the little white ones sliced up. That's all. All right, that's all. All right, listen. All y'all new people, okay? Make sure y'all hit the link in the bio and add your boy on Facebook. Follow me on IG. Subscribe to the YouTube channel, all right? So if you miss a live, you can go back and watch it, okay? I'm going to put this video on live for Tina. I mean, on YouTube for Tina to go back and watch it. Okay, uh, if you own the website, use the coupon code sale food. Okay, and uh, I, 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 I think I'll be back in the morning. I think I, if I don't, I'm back tomorrow night. All right, I got, I got, I got, I got, I got some stuff to do. I want, I want, I want to get my orders done. I want to get my orders done, so I might not go live in the morning. If I do it, baby, for a little bit, not long. All right? All right? But catch me back tomorrow night, same time, 7 o'clock or 7.30. All right? Uh, Sierra, what's your name, Sierra? What, what name you order with, Sierra? What name you order with, Sierra? Did, did you get an email, Sierra, that said your, 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 uh, did you get an email, Sierra? Did you get an email? Did you get an email, Sierra? Portia. 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 Let me see your old Portia. I don't remember seeing that name. Maybe I ain't got two of it yet, Portia. Maybe I ain't got two of it yet, Portia. How you spell that name? P O R what? P O R P O R P 
P-O-R-C-H-I-A. Okay, Sierra, I got you. Yeah, I ain't got to you yet, Sierra. From Charlotte, North Carolina. I got you, Charlotte. I got you. I see you right here. I got you. I got you. I got you. Don't worry about it. I got you. I got you. I got you, Charlotte. I got you. Trey, you get my stuff in yet? Pass the flower. Oh, damn. I'm going to get tomorrow, David. I got tomorrow. I got tomorrow. I got tomorrow. Hey, that's my boy right there, Aquarius. Y'all follow my boy right there, Aquarius. All right? Follow my boy right there, Aquarius. All right? I got the uh, event Sunday in Atlanta. Okay? Um... Pop up shop. Got an interview with my boy Aquarius. I got an interview with my boy Aquarius. Okay, Sunday. So when that when it, when it's all done and, and edited up, I y'all get the interview. So I gotta do that Sunday with my boy. Make sure y'all follow my boy. All right. And then I got the uh the other one that's on September twenty fourth. All right, in North Carolina. So, Miss Sierra, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna send you, a, I'm gonna put a flyer in your uh, 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 order. Anybody that live in North Carolina, South Carolina, I, I've been putting flyers in y'all orders for the uh, event in North Carolina, September twenty fourth. All right. All right, so read that flight, okay? Barley ain't no good. Barley ain't no good. Barley ain't no good for you. Hey, low, barley ain't no good. Barley ain't no good for you, hey, low. All right. Deborah, I got you in the morning. I got you in the morning. All right. Listen, um, like I said. Make sure y'all follow your boy on IG. Alright. Uh, add me on Facebook. Subscribe to the YouTube channel. Alright. And use the coupon code. Alright. I'm back tomorrow. Same time. Okay. Seven or seven thirty. Probably gonna be seven. More than likely. Okay. Holla at y'all.